This is my security in case any of y'all on your Will Smith shit right now. <laughs> like getting offended and running up on stage. Keep my wife's name out your fucking hands. Because, <laughs> yeah, never mind. Whatever. <laughs> That's such a cool skill, man. This is like you solve an imaginary Rubik's Cube. <laughs> Just killing shit. Is, uh. Anybody gay? Anybody at all? Anybody, anybody in the vicinity? <laughs> I know you're good with your hands, dog. Oh, I know it, dog. I know it. <laughs> this man will jerk you off with a poem. <laughs> You're so sweet. I've just never been in this position before. This is so much fun. Oh, the sacrifice. The fuck? Did, did my interpreter just get gentrified? I don't understand. Who, um, who, who are you signing for? I didn't, I didn't, I didn't even know. Um, I'm not sure. She said back there. No, it is not you, bitch. You've been here on the whole show for sure. You make us wish we were all deaf, to be honest. Uh, you don't sound deaf at all. You sound, this just seems so extra. What was your name? Nicole. Nicole. Great to meet you, Nicole. How did you, um, how did you hear about the show? Um, fuck. No, 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 no. Nice to meet you guys. This is so exciting. Thanks for coming. I just I just wanted to know. Yeah. Sounds like you don't need to be here to be honest. Let <laughs> yeah. so everybody be nice, especially you, feisty. I like your energy a lot. I'll come back there and take your fucking batteries out. I swear to God. <laughs> I swear to God, I'll turn I'll turn you off. All right. Super Bowl. <laughs> Y'all gotta chill the fuck out, man. If I have her sign something, will you relay it verbally? <laughs> you didn't know this was Deaf Comedy Jam, did you? You didn't know. <laughs> Anybody gay? Oh, really? Oh, yeah, I can't see your haircut in the dark, but yeah. Oh, yeah. How long have you been uh, lesbian? Biologically, what were you born? Female. Oh, I appreciate shit. What's your, what's your name? Charlie. I go by Axel, but my name's Charlie. Charlie, but you go by Axel. Ooh, the gangster ass name. How'd you land? How'd you land on Axel? Actually, my best friend. Your best, you let your best friend pick your name? Oh my god, my, I could never. My best friend would be like, "Your name, Baby Dick." From here on out. <laughs> you chose the name? How'd you How did you land on Axel? Carburetor. I don't know. <laughs> now you building like a transmission. But that's a Actually, you're the fucking best. Oh my goodness. Thank you for being such a sweetheart. We should go get some we should go get some bitches after this. <laughs> Let's go. I had a 14 year ago, so I am down.
Who, uh, who, who are you married to? Male, female? Uh, another trans guy. Another trans guy. Um, same situation, biologically? Okay, gotcha. Why didn't it work out? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> you were taking care of him because he was paralyzed. What, what had happened to him that he was paralyzed? A muscle disease. And he met her through TikTok. And he was DMing her like, will I ever walk again? And, he, and the medium was like, yeah, you about to walk out on your marriage. Um, where'd you meet him? Where'd you meet him? No way. I'm a, I'm a drag king, so I met him doing drag. No way! Fuck you. What's up? You have a stage name? My name is Gunner Down. Gunner Down! Oh my god. You and your 9mm? Uh, with Gunner Down as the name, I picture you going like full Rambo, just shirtless. And then you come out, your big line is like, you know I stay strapped. And you pull out a, you pull out a strap on. <laughs> Axel, you're such a sweetheart. One more time for Axel, everybody. Oh, yes, do match. Here's a matching snakeskin boots. It's both snakeskin? Python, yeah. Python. Fuck yeah. Not, not, none of those gardener snake bitches. <laughs> These are coupled up, obviously, matching. Nice. How long? Five years. Five years? Where'd you meet? In North Carolina. In North Carolina? That's specific. Where? <laughs> we met at a bar. You met at a bar? At, well, yeah. I was underage and drunk. <laughs> hey, stop talking. 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 <laughs> Under 21, okay. <laughs> you almost ruined the show. He approached you or you approached him? I don't remember. You don't remember? <laughs> also not a good sign. Uh, what do you guys do? Basket weaver. Basket weaver? What the fuck? Bro? You married to a fucking hunter-gatherer? What the fuck? You work for the fucking Easter Bunny, dog? That's coming up, that's time of the year. That's actually how he got her at the bar. He just, he laid down a trail of eggs. It was like... <laughs> and then he had one of those big picnic baskets up on a stick like this, and then she went underneath it, and he went, ah, got her. <laughs> like a fucking Looney Tune. <laughs> how long you been doing that for? Five years. Five, five years? Did she take your fucking manhood, dog? What did you do beforehand? Work at a steel mill? Coal mines. Coal mines? Are you serious? <laughs> Man made you start weeping baskets. Um, sorry. Do you like it? Yeah. Come on, man. It's just us. You enjoy the job? It's fine. It's all right. What would you like to do if you could do anything in the entire world? Any job? Fly a helicopter. Fly a helicopter. Interesting. Man, I, I used to love helicopters, but I'm also a Lakers fan. And you know what's fucked up? He's wearing a black mamba on his feet. <laughs> Can I see one of the boots? Are you able to take one of them off? This is the real deal, man. This is some real shit right here. <laughs> Smell his boot. What the fuck's wrong with you people? Jesus Christ. This is so stupid. As if, as if I would ever. You guys are dressed like the Wiggles, you know that, right? Like a Fifty Shades of Sacramento. You guys are all different. Did you purposely dress in, in different colors? I saw my face on the shirt. That was the least concerning part of the entire organization. It was really the color coordination is what's really impressive. Yellow, red, kind of pinkish, and then, and then green. Nice. 
Uh, those photos are trademarked, though, and I'm going to need $35,000. <laughs> uh, we're going to have to press charges. <laughs> and you guys look like you have the money. So I'm, fucking, I'm following through for sure. I'm sorry, I've just never met a pallet of pussy before. <laughs> this is... I feel like I'm trying to fuck in like the paint section of, of Home Depot. <laughs> You're just like, mm. Mm. You live in Washington State or DC? Is a Bigfoot up there? I haven't found him yet. You haven't found him yet? Keep looking. And make him wear the blue blazer when you find him. <laughs> I can't get over the Wiggles design, but I really can't. Like it's, <laughs> what's your guys' song? Good pussy, yummy, yummy. Good pussy, yeah, yeah. The squish it. I don't know. I don't know the rest of the fucking songs, dude. Are you guys all single? Kinda. Sorta. Of. Sorta. Of. <laughs> Only in Sacramento or what? Is it... What's that? Is it going on TikTok? It depends on how much of a disaster your lives are. I don't know. You're single. I am. What about you? I'm married, but I'm, I'm available for free drinks. <laughs> married, but available for free drinks. You out of your fucking mind? You know what? It makes total sense that you're the one dressed like a red flag. That actually takes total sense. <laughs> this completely checks out. Wow. Okay. So married. Married. Single. Divorcing. Green flag. Look at that shit. Nice. Yeah, they're so and, and then caution, like what's your deal? You know what I mean? You just you just you just kind of single floating around like well we'll see yield. Should have left ten minutes ago. Yeah, we gotta wrap this up because I'm trying to I'm trying to go back to the hotel and taste the rainbow. <laughs> <laughs> Does anybody have any weed? That's gonna help me get through this like tremendously. Good. Is weed legal in Alabama? Good, because I I personally love to vape. Uh, just regular, just regular, um, just regular. It's a hookah stick. It's pure nicotine. How cool are the cops? How cool are the cops gonna be? I feel like I feel like this this, this scene in um, fucking Gladiator. Just fucking give me a. <laughs> Why'd you let me do that? Shouldn't have done that. Thank you, officer. <laughs> Appreciate you. Thank you for, it's, it's been a white privilege. <laughs> I appreciate it. No, you do not have a white privilege card. Let me see this. White privilege trumps everything. Wow, dude. There's a back? Yes. This card grants its bearer happiness and success because it's the color of your skin and not the choices you make that determine your abilities to be successful. <laughs> Dog. Alright, now give me the N-word pass. Trades, tradesies, tradesies. Tra yeah. Nope. Y'all thought, y'all thought, y'all thought. A black man owns the company that sells me. Really? <laughs> well, if that isn't reparations. That's a beautiful thing right there. A black man selling white privilege. That, you know what? I love 2023. I'm actually totally okay with that. How did you know he had the cards? We're all now. He pulled out the card in line. That might be the whitest thing to do, by the way. <laughs> you, you, you ever heard of white privilege? Yeah, I know it's a thing. No, it's really a thing. You gotta, you gotta know a guy. You gotta, you, gotta, you, gotta, you gotta know a couple guys. You gotta know a group of guys. We all meet on Wednesdays. We all wear white. You should come in line. It's, 
good times. It's literally 13 bucks on Instagram. I didn't <laughs> 13? Like the amendment? <laughs> Has anybody ever dated somebody that they felt like because of how religious they were, it was kind of like a hindrance to the relationship? Yeah. Did you, did you really? He was a preacher? Oh, fuck. <laughs> what, uh, what, what, what religion? Pentecostal. Air Apostle? He <laughs> sold sharks? <laughs> Penicillin? <laughs> what is that? Say um, believe in speaking in tongues and things. Lucky you. <laughs> I'm not Pentecostal, but I can read lips. <laughs> yeah, I'll, be all right. yeah, I'll be okay. What was his nationality? He was white. Okay, just wanted to make sure this wasn't just regular Spanish. <laughs> and you were like, ah! <laughs> how, how old was he? 23. How old are you? 21. 21, okay. Was Preacher like his full time job? So he's not speaking in tongues, he's just, just talking shit. God, God. <laughs> you don't know if he was like talking to the devil or describing his work. Like, you flush it, it's gonna... <laughs> Somebody left a demon in this toilet. <laughs> disgusting. 21. Have you seen anybody now? Nice. Okay. No. no. What? Oh, it could be a good person. Where'd you meet this guy? I met him at a frat party. <laughs> Have you learned nothing? How in what world do you think that's better? <laughs> okay. You traded holy water for fucking jungle juice. <laughs> you don't have any kids or anything, right? No. No? Okay, good. You're 21 in Kentucky, that's like late. So I didn't know. <laughs> you know, I know some 21 year old grandmas who live, who live in fucking like, Louisville, you know what I mean? Oh! Get the fuck out of here, dude. I'm not pronouncing it like I've got a dick in my mouth. <laughs> Use all your fucking letters, okay? What are you guys, fucking British? <laughs> what, what happened with your ghost story? Uh, I was in Monterey, Mexico. Monterey, Mexico. You look like you're not from there, so visibly. <laughs> Mexico City and I was driving back to uh, Kansas. I went through Monterey. I was in a I was in a hotel room that night in our room. I was with three other people, also witnesses to this event. Mm -hmm. And there was a probably like an eight foot figure in our room. There was an eight foot figure in your room? Yeah. Mexicans are not that tall. So instinctually, you're like, that's not supposed to be here. <laughs> Unless it was just like two of them in a trench coat. Like, you know, you, know, you, know, you know when kids are trying to get into an amusement park and they're just fucking... <laughs> One adult, please. Okay, so you saw, you saw this tall-ass figure. Okay. That's a true story, man. That's the end of it? No. Okay. <laughs> Still going. So, it, it definitely... It made an indescribable sound that I cannot... It made an indescribable sound? You mean Spanish? <laughs> <laughs> this was... This was just housekeeping! And he, <laughs> he, he woke up at 9 a.m. and just heard, I clean... Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Dia de los muertes! <laughs> So it made this sound. How would you describe this sound? Like a whisper scream. Like, I mean, honestly, like a whisper scream? Was it a ghost of the yin-yang twins? What the fuck? <laughs> and then did it just disappear? Did it walk away? It left it over the bed. Oh my god. 
it levitated over the bed? It, all right, so it levitated over the bed, and you were like, ah! 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 <laughs> Please don't! <laughs> Could you guys in the back hear what happened? You can hear the story okay? I right, just wanted to make sure. Yeah, basically he was in Mexico, he was doing some gay shit with his friends. And, uh, scared him a little. What's your name? Jesse. Jesse, pleasure to meet you. What do you do work wise? I uh, take care of my two younger brothers. You take care of your two younger brothers? What do you want to do after the kids are grown? Um, <laughs> I was going to school for forensic anthropology. You, you were going to school for forensic anthropology. What's that? <laughs> so, uh, basically, I would like, look at dead bodies and try to figure out uh, what happened to them. Did you get to the point in the school where you were like face to face with a dead body? You, wait, hold on, what? I, would you rather I not repeat that? I don't care. She basically, she stopped going to school because she started having some negative thoughts and wanted to focus on some health care, some self-care. We'll, we'll, we'll phrase it that way. She was, she was not doing so well mentally, so her parents were like, here, watch our other two kids. <laughs> Jesse, you're in no position. Oh my God. <laughs> well, good luck. I hope you don't end up looking at two more dead bodies. <laughs> Whatever, you guys. Would you be like in like the morgue? Is that where where, where, you, where like your work would take place? Could be. Ah, I also fucking... thought about doing like field work, so like going where the body is. Field work. Oh, Not a term I would be using in the South, but. <laughs> Field of work, maybe, but um, <laughs> I roasted you. I figured I at least owed you a conversation. So thanks for being so sweet. Um, don't put me in your note. <laughs> Take my belt off. If I do, will you hang yourself with it? I've never been more sure somebody's from Miami in my fucking life. I'm from Houston. Worse. <laughs> Dry Miami. <laughs> Gross. Ugh. What school you go to? Rollins. Community College. Yeah. It's a private school? Sorry. Just say you came from money. Just say that. When did Paltrow's jury selection team? Is that a real thing? No. Wasn't she selling pussy scented candles? She's a what? Blog and holistic stuff. She's a blog? It's called The Goop. Goop. The Goop? That sounds like what she should name her pussy scented candles. <laughs> I wish I had been more up to date on that trial. It's all over TikTok. It'll all come up on your phone now that we've talked about it. That's fucking scary. <laughs> oh, way worse. Women's basketball. <laughs> What's that? Your mom plays professional mom basketball? In the WNBA, yes. No way. So you definitely don't come from money. <laughs> ah, I just did something your mom could never do. I dunked on your bitch ass, dog. <laughs> that was a low blow. Oh, I'm sorry. But it was also such a layup, you know? Was your mom good? Would you say she was the Dykel Jordan of the WNBA? <laughs> that is pretty cool, though. 
did you get to go to a lot of games growing up? Yeah, I did. You sat courtside? Absolutely. Was it lonely? <laughs> <laughs> we have to get out of here, you guys. No. We do. Why? Because I have a, a fantasy WNBA team to go manage. <laughs> There's also police officers here. I met a... Uh, Officer Swindell. Officer Swindell. Did you meet Officer Swindell? Oh, is that his wife? Oh man, he said you take forever to come. He said that before the show. And he dared me that I wouldn't say it at the show. You seriously gotta work on that. That's his trigger finger. And they really, like, he's got a. Oh man, now he said you guys have great sex. He said he beats it up like you fit a description. He really does. He said sometimes he lets her wear the bulletproof vest and everything. They like, hey, won't play. She puts on the bulletproof vest and then she's a teacher. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not one of your students. My bad. Sorry about that. <laughs> That's not even the last school shooting joke of the show. I lived in a crematory. You lived in a crematory? I, yeah. My old apartment was a crematory. Why do you know that? <laughs> Who the fuck just knows that statistic? Nerd. And it's right next to a nursing home. It's right next to a nursing home? <laughs> the convenience. <laughs> Beth. There's a cemetery by the Children's Hospital? Come on, Pennsylvania. Have a fucking heart, man. You do not put a cemetery next to a fucking Children's Hospital. You put it next to the school. You I told you there was one more. I fucking told y'all, man. I didn't know where or how it was gonna go, but we fucking, we found it. <laughs> All right, that's the last one. Probably. What's that? It's for you, it's a Build-A-Bear. That's for me? Yeah. What is it? It's a Build-A-Bear. You got me a Build-A-Bear? <laughs> Why? It's a voice message too in it. It has a voice yeah, message? from your show where you said it. Oh my god, so I did, I did a TikTok one time where the girl in the audience was saying it was a red flag that a guy brought her a Build-A-Bear on a first date, and I had said in the video, I was like, I would love if somebody brought me a Build-A-Bear, so you brought me one? Yeah. I gotta do more jokes about getting my dick sucked. I really gotta... Fuck, man. What am I doing with all this cute shit? Oh god, thanks, I guess. This is so sweet, thank you. Oh, your numbers are on here. It might still happen. It might still happen. Okay. We can use them for cleanup. Can I take them out of here? Yeah. This is so cute. Aww. You didn't really, you didn't spring to get him any clothes? That's kind of the whole, you didn't really build the bear. You just kind of... You kind of just psst, looks like you stole one, guy. Kind of. There's a voice my one. Yeah, press the paw. What if I press it? It's just like I want you to fuck both of us. It might be the other one. That sucks. I can't lie. That's um, that's uh, it's not incredibly audible, but it's a thought that counts. Thank you so much. This is. This is one of the, the sweetest, laziest gifts I've ever had. Thank you. Oh, back in there you go. There we go. Has anybody ever seen a ghost? Have you really? Wait, hold on. Before you get into this, does anybody have any weed? Wait, do you really? What do you have? You have a whole joint? What does she have? You have a, pe a dab pen? Can I, am I allowed to have this? Can I have... Why does it look like a pregnancy test? 
<laughs> Tastes like urine. <laughs> It's called Ghost. <laughs> what? If this isn't a sign, I don't know what is. Oh my God. Does that mean your kid's not gonna make it? <laughs> I have a friend who, around places where things happen, things happen, she'll like feel weird. like. On our uh, college campus, there's this tree, and oh when she first toured, she walked by the tree, and she just felt like she was choking. And they like looked it up later, and that's like the tree where a bunch of lynchings would happen. And like all through her childhood, like like certain places would give her like headaches or like bad feelings, and like uh, they would look it up, and it's like, oh, that's the bridge where like everyone commits suicide over and over and over, and it made her physically feel ill. So do you think like if if she entered a room where two people just got done just fucking the shit out of each other. She would be like, <gasps> I'm choking again. Oh and they're like, no, they used to shoot porn in this room. You never know. Okay, what's comforting though? She says cemeteries. She's like, cemeteries are calm. Cemeteries. Do you have anything you want on your tombstone? You guys ever think about this? Like, cause that's like the thing that people see your name, your year. What was it? A QR code. A QR code to what? Your OnlyFans? God rest her soul, but them titties can come back. God damn. About to give me a resurrection. A res erection. Come on. Man, y'all gotta hit this ghost shit. This is, uh... Did you know that it's Black History Month? You did know that. Have you learned anything yet? No? Oh, Jimmy, Jimmy, Jimmy. Does anybody have a, a Black History fact or, or statistic that would... Uh... Oh, let's hear this white guilt. What, what was it? What, what do you got? Um, um, African American um, invented the super soccer, Lonnie Johnson. What's that? They he invented the super soaker? No way! What's his name? Lonnie what? What is it? Lonnie Johnson. That's bro. That sounds like every cornerback. I used to love the super soaker, man. Okay, that's, that's a good one. What's, uh, what's, another, what's another one? He also invented the Nerf gun. The same guy invented the Nerf gun? I mean, if they're gonna keep shooting each other, might as well be safe. <laughs> Fuck y'all, dude. That's a good joke, man. Dude, can we end on a fun third? Does anybody have another one? Nope. Not looking good, Connecticut. <laughs> We've heard enough. <laughs> What's that? It used to only be a week long until a president changed it to the month. Black History Month used to only be a week long, yeah. and then a president changed it to make, to make it the whole month. Yeah. The shortest month. Yeah. <laughs> Do you know what president it was? I don't remember. You don't remember? I do want to know this actually. It was Lonnie Johnson. Bro. <laughs> yup. I was gonna give it a second. I was gonna say the same thing, bro. I was gonna act like I was Googling for 10 seconds. Lonnie Johnson. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, man. Oh, we are learning. We are learning some stuff. As we know, there's a reason you put up with crazy shit in a relationship, right? Pussy. Yo. I can't see you, but I want to believe that was God. You know what I mean? You're 52. Who are you here with, man? My wife. Oh, shit. 17 years? 17 years? What's your name, man? 
Troy. Troy, great to meet you, Troy. Sixteen year old daughter. Why? Why are you telling me that? <laughs> that seemed like a setup, didn't it? What's up? I'm Troy. Been married seventeen years. Have a sixteen year old daughter. Don't mind the math on that. Definitely got marriage out of force. <laughs> but she's fine as fuck and ready to mingle. Why you like? Why you pitch your family like it's the beginning of an episode of Next on MTV? Remember that shit? What's up? I'm Troy. I'm fifty two. I love pussy. <laughs> I got married because she got pregnant. So what, what would you say is the key to keeping things fresh and exciting after 17 years, though? Space. Space. I know she means like personal space, but I want to believe like they only jerk off to like videos of the Milky Way. You know what I mean? Like they, they just fuck to like. Audio books by Neil deGrasse Tyson. <laughs> now nah, you got fuck. You ever fucked to space? I don't want to hear about your wife's black holes, dog. I'm, I'm all right. College baseball? Oh man, you've been fingered in a dorm for sure. Okay, good. <laughs> okay. Right, so who went pro and didn't take you with them? Who was it? <laughs> All right, what, what is it that you don't like about college baseball players? Oh, my gosh. Uh, the, ego. Yeah. the ego of playing a, a collegiate sport at a high level. <laughs> you can't be proud about that. The seventh pitcher on the team. I love how you're clowning them for that, but Loki, you fucked the seventh pitcher on the team. <laughs> Yo, your pussy is the bullpen. Do you know that? <laughs> Strike one. <laughs> so it's just an ego thing? That's the only thing you don't like about it? <laughs> oh. He would... He, you never fucked him? Damn, you couldn't even fuck the seventh pitcher on the baseball team? Damn. Strike two. Where did you go to school? You didn't go to school? You didn't go to college? Strike three, bitch. Yeah! yeah. <laughs>are married? Yeah. How long? Five years. Five years? Congratulations. Thanks. Where'd you guys meet? Uh, when we were four and five. When you were four and five. Yeah. Well, you're not nine and ten, so I'll tell you, <laughs> where was this? <laughs> you grew up together. No way. Across, you fucked the neighbors? <laughs> oh my god, that's some wholesome shit right there. You hopscotched your way into some pussy, man. That's fucking amazing. <laughs> That's so adorable. Aww. How'd you shoot your shot? We were swimming. You were swimming? Yeah. <laughs> it's unhygienic from what I've heard. Um, chlorine or a river? It was a pool above ground? Yeah. Was it really? Oh, man. Do you know? Do you know how impeccable your game has to be to get some pussy in an above ground pool? <laughs> God damn, I wish I had a sketch, dude. Cause that is such a funny visual. Of, like, I imagine him just like picking her up and putting her on the side of the pool. And she's just up like this and the side folds down. <laughs> and then that giant gush of water is just like. <laughs> he's like, damn, you wet. <laughs> She's just being waterboarded on the grass. <laughs> you guys can get the visual, right? Like, yeah. Hey? Fuck yeah, dude. That's what I'm talking about, man. Uh, how long you been out and about? 
2020. Summer of 2020. Summer of 2020. Fuck, recently. Were you just that bored in the house? How old are you? 20. You're 20? So you were, you, your birthday is this Wednesday? Happy birthday, man. Um, You guys gotta compete. Who sucks better dick? That is, uh, you think so? He's got home field advantage. <laughs> All right, let's test it. Alex, get back out here. Alex, get back. <laughs> Are you single? You are single? It, you're gonna die that way if you want to be quiet. Anyway, you got any more room on your team? Because this shit is annoying. Oh. oh my god. So, no public boyfriend just yet. It's complicated. He's not shit. He ain't shit. Why do you say that? Do you, yeah. Don't cheer, you homophobes. What, 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 made, what made him not shit? Besides you in there. Because yeah. <laughs> he was blocking the pet. Whatever, dude. Whatever. Whatever. You fucking turds. <laughs> no, you were fucking turds, actually. <laughs> <laughs> so stupid. Um, I'm sorry. Real question. Have you ever seen a ghost? Hey, <laughs> there's six of us in here. I saw you. Me, 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 That's how you win a breakup. That's how, that's how you do that shit. It actually almost got into bed with her. Actually. It almost got into bed with her? So I was, I was going to sleep. Shh. I was in the end of my bed and it was mumbling in some language I did not understand. Spanish. In Spanish. You had a monster come to the foot of your bed, it was mumbling some kind of language you didn't understand, and then you thought it went away, and the covers beside you in bed lifted up, and then let back down. You farted. Shut up. Oh my god. Nice try. Ugh, smells like eggs in here. Must be a demon. I think our house is haunted, bro. Get do you hear that grumbling? Yeah, bitch, that's your guts. You sick right now. <laughs> Backtrack. Hold on. How did your How did your ex send a demon to you? Okay, so he was a very big like he did like witchcraft stuff. He did witchcraft. This is already on you. <laughs> At what point in this relationship was he like, I'm a witch? Also, real quick, aren't males wizards? Yeah. Yes. So he was a he was a wizard. You you he threatened to kill you. Why? Because I broke up with him. Valid. Well, I broke up with him the day before the year anniversary. A day before the year anniversary. Come on, but you couldn't have waited two more days. You couldn't have had the anniversary and then one day after be like that was really fun, but. <laughs> I don't think so. I think he probably had some shit planned, maybe a sacrifice for the for the one. You don't look like a virgin. I don't think it was. Gonna be that. How was the dick though? It was very small, very bad. Oh. That's why you make a deal with the devil, right there. I sell my soul for just six, Lord. I swear to God, please. I've never seen a demon. I don't imagine. <laughs> Have you seen an angel? Um, yes, I actually saw <laughs> <laughs> I keep hitting you with shit that I'm like, this is the end of the conversation for sure. Sorry. I just saw one too. <laughs> <laughs> a 
demon, I meant. I mean, a demon. <laughs> that girl looks like she'll suck your soul out. <laughs> <laughs> Just in case. How far along are you? Seven months. Seven months? Oh my god, it's almost here. It fucking hurts, right? Yeah. What would, if you could compare it, like a guy having to go through, like what do you think we would have to go through to, to, to experience something like that? Anal? <laughs> Doesn't sound that bad. <laughs> I think it's a lot worse than anal. I, w I would imagine. I think like it's, it's a different pain. I mean, you've taken a big shit before. You know? <laughs> That's basically anal. You know what I mean? Every dude in here has taken a shit so big that you're like, I could be gay, dude. Like this. This was light work, you know what I mean? <laughs> Nothing, bro. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! <laughs> no. Mila and... Roberto. Roberto? Roberto. Umberto? Sure. <laughs> I haven't heard that one before, but okay. What about you, Roberto? <laughs> what are you doing? You're a sheriff? For real? I didn't mean anything I said. I, I, I was just fucking around up here. You know what I mean? I don't even, I, it's a cool name. <laughs> and you've never shot anybody? You've shot in somebody. <laughs> Does that scare you about him like having to have a job like that that's so dangerous? It does? Yeah, if I wait like, well if I don't get a response within like two hours, I'm like, he's not dead. If you don't get a response within the two hours, you just think he's dead? Yeah. It, no, that, he could just be cheating. Like, it's not, it's, it's not always that serious. It's not always that. Y'all gotta get some more black friends, bro. I'm telling you, man. Black dudes are so fucking... Oh, y'all read a book. I, <laughs> I've got ESPN. <laughs> Y'all gotta step the fuck up, bro. Let's go. Thank you. <laughs> That's beautiful. Well, you making me scared. <laughs> Don't do that. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Especially in the dark. I can't even fight you back there, bro. <laughs> Jesus Christ. See what I mean? Don't say it, be it. What? What? You ain't a nigga, but act like one. Given a script, I just play the part, okay? I want to thank the Academy. <laughs> so trash. <laughs> Buffalo, dude. <laughs> you saw, you saw me barely touch it, right? Oh, that one right there? You knew this was gonna happen. That's why there was a backup. Oh, god damn it. Oh. Let's see. How do I... Hey guys, I don't work at Radio Shack. Fucking telling me how to do equipment stuff. There we go. <laughs> Jesus there we go. 
it's also loose, right? Uh, I gotta, I gotta hold my shit like a rapper. Oh, yeah, let's go. Well, he's got wireless. Yeah, I'll try. Oh, is there a wireless one? Oh shit, we got options. Okay. I'm gonna put this back. It's on now. Check, check. Nope, nope, nope. So what do y'all want to do after this? <laughs> it's on now, right? What else to do? <laughs> I say you up. It's not. It's still not on. I can go back to that one. Yeah. All right, here we go. <laughs> Let's fuck it. Yeah, that'll be fine. We can just leave the the core of this one off. That's okay. <laughs> I'm not. You see, I'm not even touching it, right? Like that's. I mean, this shit's bound to move around. The wireless on it should be good enough. <laughs> Bro, this shit feels... <laughs> Bro, this shit feels like I'm like the base of an orgy. And I'm just like... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, and then the, whole, the whole fucking time. <laughs> Alright, let's hope this is the one. Let's see what happens. Yeah. I fucking hate this city, man. I just should've, this shit would never happen in Albany. <laughs> I wish I could turn y'all's mic off right now. I really could. <laughs> Black dudes are the funniest people on the planet. That's a black dude for sure. I know a black dude's laugh. That's all I did all of February. I just fell asleep to black dudes laughing, man. Like, that was my ASMR. That brings me such joy. What's your name, bro? Uh, Tory, man. Who you here with? I've never been more sure somebody's with a side chick in my life. <laughs> Black dudes answer you without even answering. They really do. Who are you here with? Ah. <laughs> What's that? I said we good. Ain't nobody's cameras out. You all right, man? You okay? <laughs> but don't start no shit, man, because I'll fucking boom. Got your ass. Boom. Got you on camera, sorry. Suspicious. Oh, man. I hope I get a side chick someday. Just go do all the things I'm not supposed to in public and shit. No side. One more time? No side, just the main. That's, the, that's your main girl? Yeah, you felt the need to reiterate that? You felt the need. You're like, just to make sure. What's that? You almost got me in some shit. <laughs> You almost got you in some shit, man. Okay, this is your one and only girlfriend. No. Don't do that. Don't sit down. All right, sit down. Stop making this woman think fu the Tory fucked you. Okay, do not do that. Don't say that. No, you don't. You don't know who's sitting back there. Who's the girl you know? I know Brittany. You know Brittany? Britney forever ago. Right? Next subject. Next subject. <laughs> what, you don't like talking about black history? <laughs> Chapter one, Britney. <laughs> you said everybody knows Britney? Yeah. Britney sounds like a hoe now. Everybody knows her. Yeah. I love you, Tori. 
Hey, Tori, don't say that. Let's talk to somebody who spent Valentine's Day alone. Let's see. Virgo men are the worst. You know what's funny about this? Before I even before I even defend myself, I don't even care. I don't even believe in this shit, but I can't let it slide. Okay. Virgo men and Aquarius men. You're Aquarius. Oh, I thought you were annoying. I'm sorry. I thought you were. I'm so sorry. I, I thought. That's my bad. Why do you think Virgo men are the worst, though? You don't fuck with them? Look, I would fuck you. I just I haven't washed my hands since petting a dog. I just, I don't want to do that to you. It smells like an Aquarius. <laughs> What's that? Not you, though? Da all the other Aquarius, yeah, 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 the quiet ones, yeah. What's your name? Amelia. Amelia. Man, I wish you would disappear like Earhart. I really do. I really wish. Are you in school? Yeah. Flight school? No. What are you in school for? Business. Business? Like minding your own? <laughs> what do you want to do with a business degree? I don't know. You don't know? No, I'm just you don't know what you want to do when you grow up? No. You don't know, no I ideas? Want you just want to be rich. Nursing. Look, it's do nursing. nursing, you will be rich, for sure. I don't know if you're Filipino enough to make it, but I'm you're what? Hungarian. Hungarian? Yeah. Your parents are from Hungary, and their, and their daughter's from Thirsty? <laughs> so I just found out, apparently, I'm colorblind. Don't know how long that's been going on for, but man, I tell you what, shocked me too, came right out of the purple. Some people say that I've got a tiny cock, which is accurate. His name is Winston. He's my favorite. And now I have a tiny cock, at least I've got a huge pin. Want to know how to pleasure a woman? I know this. I know this one. Guys, you listen to her. Ladies, am I wrong? Text it right now. <laughs> you scheduling some dick? What are you doing? What's, 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 the, what's the move? <laughs> you were just looking? That's worse. Who are you texting right now? You were just looking at whose text? I saw the I saw the blue bubbles on there. <laughs> Who was it? Who's more important than me right now? I want to know who's number one in your life right now. Who is it? No, I was just looking. You were just looking at what? It better be pictures of me. It better be my Instagram. Show me if it was me. And bitch, don't you scroll to another app. I swear to God. If you open another app. You want to be real? Be present. What is your name? Lana. Lana? Lana. <laughs> Lana? Lana. You're saying exactly what I'm saying. <laughs> Lana. Lana. <laughs> Lana? Lana? Did I not just fucking say that? <laughs> Spell it. L O R N A. Lorna. Not even a real name. I see why you mispronounced it. Lorna? What's your last name? The Rings? Lorna the Rings? Oh, whatever, dude. You fucking nerds. Whatever. <laughs> you drove 200 miles for me to sit on your phone? Were you checking directions for the drive back? Is that what it was? Mm. Come on, Lana! <laughs> what was that? That was just four vowels in a row. Yeah, ah. 
Bro, British people just say fuck consonants, dude. <laughs> Look at me and my ball. Bro, who the fuck are you people, dude? Say letters. You just dip on half the words sometimes. <laughs> what do you do? I'm a buyer. You're a buyer? Of... <laughs> We're all buyers. <laughs> I can't even say it because... You won't even say it? Why? Is it people? Like, what is it? What do you buy? How bad could it possibly be? I, I buy aluminium. <laughs> she just said something that was so not a word. <laughs> aluminium? <laughs> Aluminum! <laughs> Avada Kedavra! Avada Kedavra! Avada Kedavra! You're all dead! You're all so dead, dude! Oh, fuck y'all, man. That's not a word. <laughs> Aluminium? Where are all the extra letters coming from? You're doing too much. All the aluminium. <laughs> no, fuck that, guys. You're wrong. I'm, in th I'm, I'm thinking of the spelling of it in my head. There's no I after the M. Aluminium. <laughs> Nope, not gonna do this right now. You're not gonna look, you don't have to make me look stupid. <laughs> Aluminum. <laughs> Whatever, dude. <laughs> Fuck you guys, dude. You get one word right and you think you're fucking hot shit. Oh, there you are. Yeah, you. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, I looked over, I was like, there's an empty chair there. I was like, where'd she go? You were taking a shit, it's fine. It's fine, no one's gonna have a shit. Oh, I'm embarrassing you! In front of everybody. Okay, Wednesday. Yeah, Wednesday, Adam. You just got it. Oh, you're sweet. I'm just fucking with you. I love you. I love you too. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> I was just making sure in the bathroom that I look good for you. That's it. You were just making sure in the bathroom that you look good for me? Yeah. Do a double take. <laughs> Can I tell you you look pretty just to make you feel better? First of all, you never need a man to tell you you look beautiful. So no. No, you, you look great. You look great. You. Yes, I mean it. We just said we're gonna meet out in the back. No. No. I love you too. You're very sweet. Yeah. Yes. I love watching you. Oh man. I wish you would love listening to me. You look so good. One of us has to. I'm kidding. You guys can't skip my side of the room. She, she is very beautiful. Is she your birthday? That explains it. How old are you turning? 21. That explains it. Would you like the wrist, man? Come here.
One year? Oh, that's so recent. Is he back on the market or what? <laughs> Can I ask how old you are? Can I ask how old you are? She did this. That's how old you are. Oh, turn me up. Yes, ma'am. I've never called a woman ma'am. Oh my god. I'm sorry. Yeah, yes, age. 69? Yeah, you are. Ghost off. <laughs> I love your sense of humor. You're fantastic. I love, I love you're able to like laugh about this guy. This pot's fucking Shut up. I'm taking it. Can I, this is the last thing I'm crying about. Can I, can I ask how? Or what from? Breathing problem, a lot of oxygen, or maybe you took his breath away. Murder. She said, I would love to fuck you, but... <laughs> no, 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 she, she, it's very beautiful, actually. She said when her husband was in the hospital, he was telling the doctors, like, no, this is all her fault, because she took my breath away. That's so sweet. God damn it. <laughs> How do you get your name? My name is yes, Sherry. What is it? Sherry. Sherry. That's old as fuck. That's <laughs> Yeah, you must, have been, you must have been the one Frankie Valley was singing about. <laughs> At 23, I'm in a weird spot because I'm still coming into like my body, my mind, and my face. Like puberty just happened, bro. It was so late. It was so late. I was ugly last week. Like it was bad. And now, now I look like a handsome lesbian. Like it went full spectrum. It went zero to a thousand so fast. It's made dating really difficult because apparently dudes with strong jaw lines have been treating women terribly for years and nobody told me until I got one. And now it's too late. Like, Chrissy, I get it. I look like the kind of guy who would sleep with you and not call you the next day. That's so not the case. Like, I'm so emotional, you have no idea. Like, like yeah, I might sleep with you and not call you the next day. Because I'm busy planning our wedding. Right? Do you understand how much work goes in the hour day. Like, I got stuff to do, man. You even know where to get doves? Anybody? Nobody, right? They're not on Amazon Prime. You can't post made doves. I've tried. But Chris, you know what I hate? I hate that you're not completely wrong. Like, I do suck at relationships. I'm so bad. I get too attached too easily. I know that. I'm always one to say I love you first. Like, oh, I had a great time last night. When can I see you again? Like, I'm that dude. And I think that's why I can't go to prison. Like, like it, it's not so much the showers I'm afraid of. It's just like, what if I fall in love? You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> like what if I meet the one and I get out before him? Like, now I can't go see my boo? Are you serious? <laughs> I gotta meet him with a glass every week? That's not gonna work for me. I need communication, all right? I'm back in court trying to get my sentence extended. Just please, Your Honor, I'm begging you. How do you plead? Guilty of love, Your Honor. I'll do anything. <laughs> Matt, you're only in there for a week. What happened? I was in the cafeteria, and he put me in a chokehold and said, give me your fruit cup. And I said to myself, now there's a guy who knows how to get what he wants. And now I'm Devontae's fruit cup. That's how it works. Go through a circle. He's still fucking his baby mama. Well, that's loyalty. It sounds like if, he should, if he's fucking anybody, he should be the mother of his child, no? Am I crazy for this one? It kind of sounds like you bring up a family. with his wife and his baby. <laughs> the audacity of this man to live happily ever after. <laughs> What's the problem? <laughs>
he doesn't fuck with her? No, he said he don't fuck with her, but he's lying. I think he's lying. Yes, he's lying. <laughs> That's what we call a blatant lie. I mean, maybe he shouldn't be he shouldn't be dating you on the side if he is actually interested in her. I will say that. How long have you been seeing him for? Four months. That's tough. That's that. This, you know what? This is a little too early to be having this many red flags, to be honest. Like this big of a problem this early on in the relationship, it, it might not work out. So I, my best advice would be to either I'd say break up with them or also get pregnant. Play this bitch's game, okay? Oh, that's hot. Damn. Damn. How were they? Yeah, it sounds like you do something very well that she doesn't. Hey. Like raise her child? <laughs> Maybe you might be you might be the best mom for this situation. I don't know. Man, this is the coolest episode of Dr. Phil I've ever been on. <laughs> This shit is all over the place. By the way, this isn't normally how this crowd work goes. Usually someone will be like, ah, you know, they have, I don't know, they have fucking, they wear flip-flops or something silly, but y'all like, no, my life is in pieces. He's still fucking his baby mama. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's loyalty. Yeah, that's <laughs> it sounds like if, he, if he's fucking anybody, he should be the mother of his child, no? Am I crazy for this one? It kind of sounds like you bring up a family. with his wife and his baby. <laughs> the audacity of this man to live happily ever after. <laughs> What's the problem? <laughs> he doesn't fuck with her? No, he said he don't fuck with her, but he's lying. I think he's lying. Yes, he's lying. <laughs> That's what we call a blatant lie. <laughs> I mean, maybe he shouldn't, be he shouldn't be dating you on the side if he is actually interested in her. I will say that. How long have you been seeing him for? Four months. That's tough. That's that. This, you know what? This is a little too early to be having this many red flags, to be honest. Like this big of a problem this early on in the relationship, it, it might not work out. So I, my best advice would be to either I'd say break up with them or also get pregnant. Play this bitch's game, okay? Oh, that's hot. Damn. Damn. How were they? Yeah, it sounds like you do something very well that she doesn't. Hey. Like raise her child? <laughs> Maybe. You might, be, you might be the best mom for this situation. I don't know. Man, this is the coolest episode of Dr. Phil I've ever been on. <laughs> This shit is all over the place. By the way, this isn't normally how this crowd work goes. Usually someone will be like, ah, you know, they have, I don't know, they have fucking, they wear flip-flops or something silly, but y'all like, no, my life is in pieces. You get a, you know, a bone necklace? What is it? An alligator tooth? Did you get it yourself? No way, you want alligators? That's so cool, dude. How long have you been doing that? 10 years? Seems like an odd mid-life choice to just make, to just dive into. How, how old are you? You 43? So at 33, you were like, something's missing. The fear of death. Interesting. The, uh, were you in the army before that? Oh, man. Pussy. God. Oh, my God. What did you do in the army? You kill people? Ah. Yeah, right. <laughs> Can't do shit. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Being a comedian. <laughs> what do you do? You're a personal trainer. Have you ever used roids? <laughs> you have an you have an answer? Okay. Well, I don't know if you guys know this, but when a woman uses steroids for personal training, her uh, clit grows massively. So we might not be able to fuck, but we could, I don't know, dock. Yeah. 
he'll rip that shit off and put it on a necklace. <laughs> So gross. <laughs> oh my god, that's the dumbest thing I've ever said. That's so gross. He doesn't like when you go out with your friends. He doesn't like when you go out with your friends? Are they guy friends? Are they whores? <laughs> I don't know, that's tricky. I gotta beat all your friends. And are they hotter than you? <laughs> Preferably yes. <laughs> it's like, cool, alright, you're not gonna be the star. Good. You're not gonna be the star. Is that, is that something you're dealing with currently? Yes, something friends deal with. Yeah. It's something your friends deal with? Yeah. yeah. Is that friend here? I know. You are the friend? <laughs> <laughs> so you're in a relationship right now with a guy who doesn't like you going out with your girls? No, no, I'm single. But She's I'm, single. I bet. Well. <laughs> Your She's the single friend that he doesn't like her going out with. Oh. <laughs> so you fuck around. <laughs> Call him up. I need both sides of the story right now. Alright, this is this is your best friend, I assume. And now she's clashing with your boyfriend, so What the fuck is happening in this story right now? This story has changed seven times. I thought you said she was single. Her best friend has a controlling boyfriend. Where is the girl with the boyfriend? Not here. Oh, this bitch in a basement somewhere? Oh my god. Okay. Oh my god. She's not missing much because this story sucks, man. Uh, good luck explaining this to the cops. <laughs> Where is she? Well, my friend has this boyfriend who's like kind of controlling with his friend's girlfriend. And then... so good forearms on you, says her sisters. What's your name? Casey. Casey and Jesse. Jesse. Pleasure to meet you, Casey and Jesse. You guys are adorable. Where'd you guys meet? In Columbus, Ohio? You guys drove from Ohio? You're not even allowed to be gay up there. That's crazy. <laughs> Stay down here. Well, well, maybe. Let's go west a little bit. Yeah. Um. You got here yesterday. And you going back tomorrow? Did you guys do anything fun for Easter? Repent, maybe? <laughs> Did you guys go to church this morning? You had food poisoning? Fuck. Eating the wrong fish. <laughs> Clean up your life. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Now, what's Penn's mechanic exactly in, in Columbus? It's like a arcade bar. An arcade bar? Like um, pinball machines and stuff like that? Nice. Just work on your finger and just. <laughs> Interesting. Do you remember? Who'd you come out to first? You don't mind me asking. Your friends? And did they know? They were like, yeah, bitch, you, you, look, you dress like that. You don't skateboard at all. You're young. You don't have to do it anytime soon. But would you ever want kids, you think? If I'm rich. If you're rich? Yeah. Well, you're going to have to stop working at an arcade bar. <laughs> That's step number one. Oh, man. I go through backpacks like crazy. Like, because I fly so much and they always fuck up my bags. It's always the, like the, the, the lining on like where the strap meets the actual backpack. It gets fucking torn from always carrying so much shit. I, I go through more straps than you guys do. <laughs> I was trying to get to it. I was like, how can I, how can I squeeze that in without any lube, you know? Mm. That's so cute, man. I wish I was gay. Yeah. I'd never pay for it. You calm down back there before I have her come back there and peg the shit out of you. I swear to God. What gets in the way the most? Communication, I guess. Communication. That's a big one. 
Well, it doesn't always need to be verbal, you know. I'm sure you guys are pros at reading lips. <laughs> you know, settle it, rock, paper, scissors. You know? Like adults. You got your foot up on stage the whole, you hella comfortable, man. What, what kind of work you need those boots for? Electrical contractor. Electrical contractor, nice. You ever been electrocuted? I have. Well, yeah. shocked. You been shocked? Yeah. Like finding out your daughter's a lesbian? <laughs> You did IVF, inver, infertile, in, uh, uh, <laughs> infertile vitro asphyxiation. <laughs> they put eggs yeah. and semen inside you, yeah. and then they just fucking. <laughs> so this is my impression of them after an argument. <laughs> Did you know it was going to be two? Like, did you know you were selecting twins? Yes. Oh, really? I didn't know you could do that. Sex. You had to choose the sex. You can't do that. Cancel. <laughs> cancel, 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 cancel. Shame. This is what I was talking about, man. With Nashville, so funny. You guys were like, no school shooting stuff. But I was like, a little bit of transphobia. And you guys were like, yeah! <laughs> we're back in it, baby! <laughs> uh, yeah, you can't make fun of the kids, just the shooters. Yeah, I get it. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> you scared the shit out of me, dog. <laughs> bro, I'm not Chris Rock, though. I'll kick you in your chest, bro. I swear. To God. Are you dapping me, or you want the hoodie or my wallet? What do you want? Uh, careful, dog. Careful. Do y'all watch Criminal Minds? One handsome motherfucker at a time, dog. Did you have some fun? I ain't got jokes like this motherfucker right here. I'm Juan Moore. I don't know when I got here. I've been watching him on YouTube. And, I, and I'm meeting him for the first time tonight. I'm seeing him live in person. Like a lot of us, I'm sure. For the first time, but I've been watching it, me and my girl, my baby mom, and, and my girl comes to me and she's like, Shamar, you're the sexiest motherfucker in the world, Jen, you're the father of my daughter, but I want to fuck Matt right. Check this out. We're going to meet the motherfucker, but you ain't going to fuck. Uh. <laughs> but the, re the reason I'm here is because I like seeing motherfuckers win. I like to see motherfuckers in And, this, and this, this young white boy, who wants to say nigga so bad, <laughs> he does all his friends are black. <laughs> but he can't say it, because he'll get pissed. So when he comes to my house, I'm going to say, get it out of your system. Nigga, 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 nigga. The reason I'm here is because I've never met this man. I just watched him on YouTube, and I was like, yo, this motherfucker's funny, and he's pretty. And, and no, but like, pretty people ain't supposed to be fun. Kevin Hart is not pretty. He's short, and he's funny. Chris Tucker, motherfucking damn! Okay? Dave Chappelle is rich as fuck. He's not Chef. pretty. True. I'm pretty, goddamn it. But he's honest, he's real, and he's funny. And I DM'd him like a bitch. And he DM'd me back like a bitch. So now we got a romance going on. And I said, I'm gonna come to your show, and I'll pay you like a bitch. But he did give me the tickets for free. So I'm gonna get off this stage, but I just wanna say, I believe that this dude is on his way. He sells out every show. Uh, and I believe, I believe you are going to see Matt Wright 
And whatever is in his heart, and like all, all his jokes and all of that stuff. And I want to see this motherfucker in front of a bunch of niggas. Because I think he can handle himself. But my point is, let's applaud the bravery, the boldness, the unapologetic. Appreciate you, man. Thank you, brother. Thank you, man. Thank Respect. you, bro. Can I add it? He's stealing. <laughs> Go stairs this way. Yeah, be careful. One more time for Tay Diggs. I seem frustrated. A gift maybe help? Maybe after the show. No. <laughs> oh, no. Thank you so much. What is this? Well, don't clap. It could be a bomb. We don't know. We don't know yet. I came to Iowa and I, I guess... Yeah. Listen, guys, I've never ended a show early before, but I, I'm sure you would all understand if I had to wrap things up, right? There's, oh, there's one more thing in here. Cookies! Are you kidding me? The blowjob's gonna have a hard time beating this. this is fantastic. It's like the perfect consistency, too. Oh, my God. Thank you so much. What's your name? Christina, you are so hot. Thank you so much. Oh my God. You're a grandma? Yeah. Let's put that shower chair to use. There's already plastic on the furniture. Let's make a mess, you know? How old are you? Say it. Say it. <laughs> this is dirty talk to me. Come on. Let's, 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 45. 40, 45? Are you serious? Are you, are you from here? Really? We gotta get you out of here. We gotta get you the fuck out of here. Minneapolis at least. Let's just get you, out. Let's just get you down the road. You're not married or anything? You bunch of fucking idiots. Oh my god, you local morons not marrying this beautiful woman who makes great cookies. Stupid. I'm so sorry. What, are you divorced? How long were you married for? 16 years. 16 years? Ah, I'm so sorry. <laughs> How many kids do you have? Four. Oh, what? That's enough though, right? You have your tubes tied? You do? I'm gonna fucking move in the morning. Yeah. Uh. These are my sisters. Those are your sisters? You have three sisters? Um, I'm the oldest out of nine. Nine? <laughs> Would you like to have such a hot older sister? Does she know she's hot? Does she know that? No. She doesn't? No. Good. <laughs> Keep her humble. You're nothing, Christina. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna be stuck here in Iowa forever unless, unless, uh, uh, that's gaslighting. <laughs> What's that? What was it? What did you want to show me? Was it a bank statement? What was it? Your daughter? <laughs> this is your daughter? Are you serious? No, nobody else can see her, actually. This is, I don't want Iowa to know she's out here. This is, this is your daughter? How old is she? This is the 21 year old? <sighs> this is a very tough decision to make, you guys. I don't know if you've ever been put in this position. But. She's in Jacksonville, Florida? I'll be down there. Maybe later on this year. She looks exactly like you. This is insane. Yes, she does. She's gorgeous. All right, so I'm gonna date you for the next 10 years and then we'll, we'll trade up. 
fuck, this is about to be the most uncomfortable Thanksgiving I've ever been to. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, because if you taste this good, it's going to be a problem. <laughs> What's your biggest fear? Uh, losing my kids. Losing your kids. You might find them. <laughs> no, that's, that's bad. But if the one in Jacksonville goes missing, mind your business. <laughs> She's in good hands. <laughs> Got your phone? All right, let's swipe out of Instagram and see what else is in here. <laughs> now let's go through a photo album. Let's, um... No, wait. <gasps> Here's the thing. Here's the thing. I won't open it if you just tell me what's in there. I had a lump in my breast. You had a lump in your breast? I had a mammogram. You had a mammogram recently. Mm -hmm. And so I FaceTimed my daughter, the hot one. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah, you're not going to ask for ugly people's advice. <laughs> yeah, I totally get it. So there's screenshots of her and I FaceTimed me. With just a tit out. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck. Because, <laughs> like, you know it's in the palm of your hand. <laughs> ah! Did you get the results back? Yes. You're okay? I'm okay. Need a second opinion? <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure? Text messages. Text Maggie. Is that Maggie your daughter? FaceTimer. <laughs> Maggie, that is not your angle. <laughs> Where are you right now? Do you, do, you, do, you, do you know how hot your mom is? I know, I know. You're well aware of your competition, right? Like, you know you can't bring anybody home. I know. Um, your mom was stupid enough to, to give me her phone, and I was going through your guys' text history, and, uh, gross. But I'm glad, I'm glad she got that lump checked out, though. I checked it out. Everything's totally okay. Second opinion. Everything's totally all right. see your kitties? Sure did. Sure did. And, um... You're a lucky motherfucker. <laughs> I don't know. All right, Maggie, say bye to your mom real quick. Bye, Mom. I love you. Bye, <laughs> bye Maggie. <laughs> Here are them. What do you mean? They fucked them up. What do you mean they fucked them up? Who fucked up your titties? <laughs> the doctor? Do you have fake boobs? Fuck. Um, <laughs> prove it. <laughs> what do you? They make sounds. Like, like what? Like, like what? What? What sound do fake titties make? Cha-ching. <sighs> Thank you guys for coming on this date with Christina. And I. I hope you guys have thoroughly enjoyed watching me ruin this family. <laughs> what was that? What the fuck? You're lying. That did not just happen. You was that a real thing? has a squeaky toy in her titties. And you talking to a doll. <laughs> crazy. Oh, oh. 
What? I don't think that's a mistake. I think that's the best thing to have ever happened. You can get squeaky toys inside your titties? Can you customize them like a Tesla horn? What made you get them done? Four kids. Four kids? You breastfeed? Two of them. Damn. Because you know it goes great with cookies. Milk. Silicone. Texting right now. You scheduling some dick? What are you doing? What's, 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 the, what's the move? You were just looking? That's worse. Who are you texting right now? You were just looking at who's text. I saw the I saw the blue bubbles on there. Who was it? Who's more important than me right now? I want to know who's number one in your life right now. Who is it? You were just looking at what? Better be pictures of me. It better be my Instagram. Show me if it was me. And bitch, don't you scroll to another app. I swear to God, if you open another app. You want to be real? Be present. What is your name? Lana. Lana? Lana. Lana? Lana. You're saying exactly what I'm saying. Lana. Lana. Lana? Lana. Did I not just fucking say that? Spell it. L-O-R-N-A. L-O-R-N-A. Lorna. Not even a real name. I see why you mispronounced it. Lorna? What's your last name? The Rings? One of the rings? Yeah. Oh, whatever, dude. Fucking nerds. Whatever. <laughs> you drove 200 miles for me to sit on your phone? <laughs> Were you checking directions for the drive back? Is that what it was? Mm. <laughs> what was that? That was just four vowels in a row. Yeah. <laughs> Bro, British people just say fuck consonants, dude. <laughs> Look at me and my ball. Bro, who the fuck are you people, dude? <laughs> say letters. <laughs> you just dip on half the words sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> What do you do? I'm a buyer. You're a buyer? Of... <laughs> We're all buyers. I can't even say it because... You won't even say it? Why? Is it people? Like, what is it? What do you buy? How bad could it possibly be? She just said something that was so not a word. <laughs> Aluminium? <laughs> Aluminum! <laughs> die! Die! Avada Kedavra! Avada Kedavra! Avada Kedavra! You're all dead! You're all so dead, dude! Oh, fuck y'all, man. That's not a word. <laughs> Aluminium? Where are all the extra letters coming from? You're doing too much. All the aluminium. No, fuck that, guys. You're wrong. I'm, th I'm, I'm thinking of the spelling of it in my head. There's no I after the M. Alum. Nope. Not gonna do this right now. You're not gonna. You don't have to make me look stupid. Aluminum. you guys, dude. You get one word right and you think you're fucking hot shit. I'm from Saudi Arabia. You're from Saudi Arabia? Yeah. Welcome to Ohio. <laughs>
This, uh, if it, this is your first time in Columbus? Sorry. Oh, you guys are from Cleveland. Oh, never mind. Enjoy Columbus. <laughs> crack is pure. <laughs> he misses Saudi Arabia so much, he came all the way to Cleveland to find some bomb-ass pussy. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> How's the comedy scene in Saudi Arabia? People, do, people, do people laugh? Yeah. Most of the men? Uh, women. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't get your names, I'm so sorry. I'm Kaylee. Kaylee and what? Dude. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna make it easy. I make it easy for me, let's go. Like saying dude, but you're gonna add W, so we dude. Like dude, but with a W, would dude. But it's mean the most lover in Arabic. It means the most lover? Aww. You big dick slinger, you. Aww. You and your weapon of mass destruction. Aww, he's so cute. Do you really wanna know my full name? I wanna know your full name more than anything. You gonna take a note? No, I got it. It's all up here, dog. If someone said I'm gonna give it whatever they want. Really? Yeah. You'll give me whatever I want if I can pronounce yeah. your name if correctly. You say my full name. Will you give me whoever I want? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> you can't do that here, my dude. You can't do that. You can't just be giving people away, okay? Anymore. Hey guys, we haven't always been a cool country, okay? <laughs> Alright, well dude, lay it on me, dog. Right. It's Abdul Wadud, Abdul Rahim, Ruh al Amin, Abdul Yo, somebody put this motherfucker in reverse. Did y'all hear that shit? Oh, sounds like somebody rewound this motherfucker. <laughs> It sounds like it was like, I'm new here, I love America, Cleveland is awesome, Columbus is so much better. Take it back one more time. What <laughs> well, dude? We have to have our parents and grandpas and great grandpas and then family. So you'll be known when someone like me, you out there, uh -huh. like, oh, is that your grandpa? Oh, that's your grandson? So that's how we know each other. That was more confusing than your name was, to be honest. That was far more confusing. I love you, dog. I really do. Absolute pleasure to meet you, man. Pleasure to meet you, too. Uh, what'd you say? Well, it's my pleasure to meet you, too. Oh, you said it so right for me. <laughs> he, said, he said it with like a strong accent at first, but then he went, it is my pleasure to meet you, too. That's why I'm going to turn into Siri real quick. You're a cool ass dude, man. So, um, Columbus, we, uh, we gotta get out of here. Uh, I, I know, I know. Somebody's gotta catch a flight. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> you scared the shit out of me, dog. <laughs> Bro, I'm not Chris Rock, though. I'll kick you in your chest, bro. I swear to God. Are you dapping me or you want the hoodie or my wallet? What do you want? <laughs> careful, dog. Careful. Do y'all watch Criminal Minds? <laughs> Alright, hey, one handsome motherfucker at a time, dog. Did you have some fun? I ain't got jokes like this motherfucker right here. I'm far more. I've been watching him on YouTube, and, I, and I, I'm meeting him for the first time tonight. I'm seeing him live in person, like a lot of us, I'm sure, for the first time. But I've been watching him, and me and my girl, my baby mama, and, I, and my girl comes to me, and she's like, Shamari, you're the sexiest motherfucker in the world, Jenny, you're the father of my daughter, but I want to fuck Matt right. It's because I like seeing motherfuckers win. I like seeing motherfuckers win. And this, and this, this young white boy, who wants to say nigga so bad, <laughs> he does all his friends are black. <laughs> but he can't say it, because he can't guess. But when he comes to my house, I say, 
texting right now. You were just looking at who's tag. I saw the I saw the blue bubbles on there. Who was it? Who's more important than me right now? I want to know who's number one in your life right now. Who is it? You were just looking at what? Better be pictures of me. It better have been my Instagram. Show me if it was me. And bitch, don't you scroll to another app. I swear to God, if you open another app. You want to be real? <laughs> be present. <laughs> what is your name? Lana. Lana? Lana. <laughs> Lana? Lana. You're saying exactly what I'm saying. <laughs> Lana. Lana. <laughs> Lana? Lana. Did I not just fucking say that? <laughs> Spell it. L O R N A. L O R N A. Lorna. Not even a real name. I see why you mispronounced it. Lorna? What's your last name? The Rings? Lorna the Rings? Whatever, dude. You fucking nerds. Whatever. <laughs> you drove 200 miles for me to sit on your phone? <laughs> Were you checking directions for the drive back? Is that what it was? Mm. <laughs> what was that? That was just four vowels in a row. Bro, British people just say fuck consonants, dude. <laughs> Look at me and my ball. Bro, who the fuck are you people, dude? Say letters. You just dip on half the words sometimes. What do you do? 
I'm a buyer. You're a buyer of. <laughs> We're all buyers. <laughs> I can't even say it because. You won't even say it? Why? Is it people? Like, what is it? What do you mean buy? How bad could it possibly be? She just said something that was so not a word. Aluminium? Aluminum! Die! Die! Avada Kedavra! Avada Kedavra! Avada Kedavra! You're all dead! You're all so dead, dude! Oh, fuck y'all, man. That's not a word. Aluminium? Where are all the extra letters coming from? You're doing too much! All the aluminium. No, fuck that, guys. You're wrong. I'm, in th I'm, I'm thinking of the spelling of it in my head. There's no I after the M. Alum. Nope. Not gonna do this right now. You're not gonna. You don't have to make me look stupid. Aluminum. You guys, dude, you get one word right and you think you're fucking hot shit.